Hey everybody, in today's video, I'm gonna show you how to adjust your plot area for the barometer on your Garmin Instinct 2X. As with most features on this watch, this is also something you could change on the Garmin Connect app, or you could do it on your watch, and I'm gonna be showing you how to do it on your watch. The plot area is gonna come into play in a bunch of different places. For example, if you use this watch face that shows your plot area, when we go make this change, it will also change it on this watch face. We'll look at that here in a second. The one thing that it doesn't have anything to do with is this little arrow that you see here. This arrow is what's called your barometric pressure trend. This arrow will always represent a six hour period. The first left half of it is three hours uh, prior, to the prior to the current three hours. And then the right side of it is going to be the last three hours. I hope that made sense. So this arrow here is showing that in the last six hours, my barometric pressure has been stable. The plot area has nothing to do with that arrow. It's gonna to have to do with this here. So how do we do this? The easiest way to me is go into your barometer. If you press and hold the bottom left button of the watch, that's your ABC button, it will always take you to your altimeter, barometer, and compass, unless you change that with your hotkeys, which I do not recommend doing. When you get in there, it will take you to the last of those values that you use. So in my case, the last thing I used was the compass. I'm going to use the up or down button, and we need to go to our barometer. When we go into your barometer, it will show you what your plot area is set to. Mine is set to six hours, and you'll notice in the barometer, it looks the exact same as what we just saw in the watch face. While I'm in my barometer, if I simply press the GPS button, it will take me to a submenu. I'm going to use the down button. I'm going to go to settings, press the GPS button to choose settings, and then I'm going to press the down button a couple of times, or sorry, just one time to go to the plot area. Mine is set to six hours. If I press the GPS, these are your different options. This is what's nice about Garmin is they give you your barometer. Uh, you, they give you some options to look at your barometric pressure plot, whereas on your Casio Pro Treks and stuff like that, it's always a 24 hour period. I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to change mine. The maximum you can do is 48 hours. You can do 24, 12, or 6 hours. Choose the value you want by pressing the GPS button. And then we can press the back button. It's going to take us back to our submenu for our barometer. Press it back one more time. It'll take us to our barometer. And now you'll notice that our plot area has adjusted. Instead of seeing it for the last 6 hours, we can see our barometric pressure change over the last 48 hours press the back button again, you'll notice when I get back to my watch face, it has also changed on my watch face. Now I'm seeing my barometric pressure trend over the last 48 hours. As I mentioned before though, the arrow up here has not changed because that barometric pressure trend arrow will always be looking at a six hour value. Anyway, pretty easy stuff. I hope that helps. That's how we change the plot area for our barometer on the Garmin Instinct 2X.